like lots of Eugene over there. <laughs> Nathan Negge of Beaverton, Oregon, the junior. Lots of five yards. Number two. Time out, Michigan State. This is maybe the longest one minute and four seconds of the Spartans' lives right now. They just cannot wait to clear the Northwest. And there it is. Uh, you got to take your hat off, though, to Burke. He's, he hasn't quit competing out there. He's uh, struggling for everything. And this gives him some experience, too. And he hasn't had a lot of playing time. I'm sure that this isn't the way he wanted it, but uh, he's getting it. And he'll have to be the man next week against Notre Dame, we would figure. And shoulder injury didn't look that good for the youngster. Spartans have a few problems with the injuries today against Oregon. Yeah, Amp Campbell. Their fine corner out with a stinger. Going down again. Nothing a man can do. Jed Boyce. Gold Beach, Oregon, the junior, adding to the sack total. And Oregon just rushed three guys that time. They had one defensive lineman drop out and spy on the quarterback. So we are going to wrap it up here and not send you to New York at all. Down goes Burke. And Walker a, Templeton. And not a bad way. Montana. Montana. <laughs> I knew you get a Montana guy in there before too long. <laughs> not a bad way for Oregon's defense to start off the season. Three sacks in a row and uh, turn the ball That's over to their offense one more time before time runs out. I got bad news for you, though. Oregon State's had 48 to nothing. That's good news for all uh, the folks I'm here in the, in the great Northwest. Yeah, of course, they're playing uh, Nevada. Nevada. The Wolfpack having some problems, but uh, that is good news for the Beavers up there in Corvallis.